Greetings, beloved. Welcome back in, my beautiful soul. Thank you for being here. Much love and appreciation to you. If it's your first time here, come on in, subscribe. Let's be family. You know, my focus here is to help as many people as possible to learn the ways to heal naturally. I also am looking to learn from you because I believe as a community, we all have knowledge. We all have a purpose that we can add to each other to make life better for all of us. That said, one love and let's focus on the sacral chakra. This is a bonus session pretty much to put everything together that I've been teaching about the sacral chakra and how to balance it. Now, you can use the color orange to help you to bring balance to this chakra. If you're an artist, you can paint with lots of different shades of orange. Or you could just experiment with that if you're not an artist like I do. I, I'm not a painter, but I, I like to paint. You could use crayons. Just work with whatever you have. You could wear orange clothing. You could change your bread sheets and stuff into orange. You could, you know, put up accessories around your home if you're into home de deco and stuff like that. Your curtains, your pillows, you know, orange fly. I mean, we're in the orange season anyway, so why not? Let's get that sacral chakra balance. And you could also do anything that you consider that brings out your creativeness, your creative side. Maybe blindfold yourself a little bit and allow it to help you to find your intuition. Do a blindfold challenge. Nothing dangerous or crazy. You know, something fun. Have fun with it. That said, you can use the essential oils and when you're using that, you want to make sure you put it where you can smell it and inhale it. You could put it on directly, but always remember, if you're new to essential oils, you want to test it out first to make sure you're not allergic. And like I said in a previous video, make sure the source of your oil is organic and that it's respectfully sourced because we have to have respect for our planet. Numero uno. Now, in addition to this, you want to have the foods that go with your sacral chakra. If you're not familiar with those, check those videos. And also the crystals, if you're into that, that goes with the sacral chakra. You could do a combination of these things to bring balance to this beautiful chakra. That said, if you have any questions, please let me know. I'll be so happy to answer. And remember, you are divinely blessed. You are a creator. And I'll say that again. You are a creator. Remember, your sacral chakra is your creative center. Your sensualness, sexuality, your emotional well-being. This is your center of your creativeness. I have to say that again because it truly is. Your self-expression. It is so paramount to be who you are meant to be and to truly express from deep within your true essence that said live boldly live creatively live balanced live well now if there's anything in this video that you loved or liked or that was beneficial to you in some way please like the video share and subscribe it helps YouTube to recognize the work that I'm doing here so it is going to help me to grow and share my knowledge with more and more beautiful souls like you. Thank you and be always blessed.